Go, brother. Cheer, brothers. <laughs> We're down here at the local river. Got the Hinaki, brother. Got Awatezmi fishing out there. Just gonna throw this bitch in there and see what we get. <laughs> nice and deep, brother. Come back the next day, brothers. And, well, I should have a mean feast. And here we just have a mean, mean little, little sinker with a hook on them. Try to catch a monster one on this. Mmm. So just over there we've got the Hinaki line going straight down over there and way off in the distance on that branch that's just leading out over the water got our nice line and hook over there with our sinker Check Oh, right here arrived back at the river. Oh, we'll just pick the line soon. Leave that one down here. Oh, let's see what we got. <laughs> well, we had him. We had him. But, um... Seems to me like he just he just fell off. <laughs> um, so we'll we'll rebait this one. We'll rebait this and then uh, toss it back out like that. So yeah. Alright, as you just seen our main incident over there with that other eel. So hopefully we got something in the trap. We got here. Yeah. Yeah. As you can tell, we've caught all the eels. So you can tell there's uh, nothing in there. So we'll just uh, toss it back in the next time. But as you can tell, there was eel slime all over it. Yes. So we're back at the river again. We've got six more lines in the bag to feed the whanau. You know, we're going to get them a big feed and smoke some eels up. Check. Oh, so we have found a hole in our hinaki right here and I think the eels have been getting out of the hole Fuck So we checked the hinaki again This is what we caught A rare species of cockabully It's actually a saltwater fish but they go in and out from rivers into the salt water So yeah Yep, okay So we'll set the hinaki again Got another line here. That's just got a sinker and a hook with a bit of steak attached to the end of it. Um, where's this one? We've got another one straight down the bottom here. Right here, just goes right down to the bottom on the ground. Same thing, sinker and the hook. So we've got the one that we caught the first deal, but it fell off on. So in the same spot, and we got two. And we've got two that are just sitting right here. One's going straight down and one's a bit far out. So yeah, hopefully we catch something fine, eh? Sure. Might as well. So fine, eh? We're back at the river checking lines. These two have nothing on them, like last time. Right, so hopefully there's a tunnel on the end of this. And there was nothing. Absolutely nothing. Nothing. 
Two fine oak, we just made a big turn to the river it might fall on. Let's go see what we caught. Oh, so we caught nothing on the lines, but uh, hopefully we've got something in the hinaki. Alright, so we're pulling up the hinaki and oh, it looks like we've got something in there. Hopefully, have a look. Oh, we've got a couple in there. Oh, open her up, see what we got. They're up there, so they don't slip away. This week's in there. Fuck, oh, check that out, Fano. That's how we do it here. So we just forgot about this one, but... Oh, here yeah, looks like we're on. Oh, it's another good size, good eating size here. Oh, check that one out, fun, eh? Sure look good on the smoker. Oh yeah, so we're just gonna tip it all out now. Hopefully they don't run away into the grass. Here's our load this fun, eh? Oh, the breaker in here. Right up, up here. They're all running away. Oh no. <laughs> Grab the basket, you think? Come back to me, bro. <laughs> Open the bag. Yeah, Farno. Oh, Farno. So we've caught our, our eels. Just gonna lie that just in the bag here. Just gotta lift the hinaki up. But uh, I'm gonna take them home, hang them on the clothesline overnight, and uh, oh, I'll catch you in the morning when we're ready to smoke them up. Okay. Sure to find out. These are all our eels from, from our Hinaki and line. Nice. Be ready for the smoke in the morning. Sweet. So we've just uh, cut up and filleted our eels. We're gonna glaze them with a bit of salt and brown sugar and then put them in the smoker for a couple hours. Cheer. Just finish putting the sugar on, the salt on. I'm just putting some brown sugar on them now. So there you wanna get a nice coat on there. Some of them taste a bit out of. As you can see, we just put our mean as eels in the smoker. Got some sawdust over there, some manuka sawdust. I'm just gonna sprinkle that on there and it'll be cut off.